Hi guys, welcome back to Simply Spiritual. It's going to be a general reading for the 29th of April. It is general, so it may or may not resonate with you. Take off fifths, leave the rest. <coughs> and characters in the story can always be reversed, vice versa. Alright. Right, I'm going to start off with the deck I created. Love Oracle, links down below, available on Etsy. Going on with the collective. Going on with the collective for the 29th of April. Okay. First card out is we have toxic relationship. My cat is tweaking out. Alright. Anything else? And hook up. Okay, cat, calm down. Why is he freaking out all of a sudden? I turn on the camera. Toxic relationship and hook up. Oh my goodness, cat. What is wrong with that? Anyways, um, all right. Anything else about this? Hold on. It's a different deck. <clears throat> it's like a weird combo of cards. Alright, anything else to describe what is going on here? You have toxic relationship and hookup. Okay. Taking steps. <clears throat> and we have joyous fun well i'll tell you right now i don't think a toxic relationship is much fun what are we taking steps towards Sacred Temple. Hold on a second. <clears throat> Come on. Oh my goodness. This card unveils your ultimate place of power and inspiration. The sacred temple is the seat of your soul. It's always available to you as a source of peace, balance, and connection to spirit. You can access this wonderful place by meditating on your own heart. Receiving this card upright is telling you it's time to do so. You're at the point in your life <clears throat> in your personal power where you are able to open this holy vault and connect with the unlimited information contained therein. It's like taking steps to sorry my dad just texted me um <clears throat> i'm confused tell me about this toxic relationship the chaser codependent Chaser and codependent relationship, fear of abandonment. abandonment. So someone's holding on to a toxic relationship here. Okay, and that's a little more clear here. Um, why are we holding on to this? Well, it says codependent, but someone may be holding on to a codependent toxic relationship. What's up with this hookup? Coffin, ending spring, new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, transition. It almost feels like this reading has two sides, but I don't want to go there yet. Um, tell me more about this hookup. 
girl talk, time with friends, moving on, happily single, living in the moment, having fun. This talks about having fun as well. So what's up with this toxic relationship though? Is it ending? New love. So it feels like someone's working towards ending a toxic situation, right? But then we have this hookup, you know, being single, endings, <clears throat> joyous fun, and then new love. Anything else I'm missing here? grass is greener in this situation it feels like the grass is greener because we have toxic relationships so again we're kind of talking third party but I, there's no instance there's no indication of a overlap um but i feel like we have someone kind of being aware because it's taking steps towards a sacred temple being aware that there may be been holding on to a toxic relationship and it's not happy anymore and then moving on to something that's happy <clears throat> else the wolverine fierce unpredictable elusive what is this wolverine what is this wolverine here hold on the island talks about being alone solo what is this supposed to mean The butterfly, an amorphous change. <clears throat> Things working against you, but persistence pays off. The beaver. <laughs> Tell me more about this toxic relationship. The home could live with this person and the broom don't need it don't need it unwanted unpleasant repetitive feels good but it's over so it definitely feels like someone's becoming aware of a toxic relationship that they're in anything else about this toxic relationship judgment final decision rider green light messenger movement they just go it's like someone suddenly realizes that the grass is greener now it doesn't mean something's already lined up it just means that away from this being alone and lonely is actually greener here <clears throat> anything else about this hookup albatross a good sign or omen how does it put this hookup The wheel, destiny, fate, wine could be involved with drinking. I also talked about developing over time, so maybe whatever this was has been developing over a long time. This new love here, this hookup. Anything else? Fixed signs. Gemini. The lovers. Lovers can be. Choice between two lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini as well. It also says four to eight weeks. Um, fixed signs. Talks about being stubborn or stuck. Someone was stuck in a toxic relationship. Basically the point here is the grass is greener. Woman. I mean that's pretty much all I feel here. It doesn't feel, you feel very detailed. It's just like the grass is greener. Realizing that the grass is greener. Any final thoughts here? Liquid courage. It's definitely something about drinking here because we had wine. Um, I think this other situation possibly happens due to alcohol. It doesn't feel bad though. Anything else about this new situation?
seduction, attraction, flirting, dating, hooking up, temptation, third party interference. Woohoo, again. Hook up. There's definitely a hook up here. Probably involving alcohol, right? But then there's also something. What it feels like happens here is someone breaks up with someone. <coughs> God. <coughs> Decides that they're better off being alone and lonely and that the grass is greener even though it may feel like it's going to be lonely but then you know someone goes out drinking blah 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 has a hookup they're single whatever but i think it turns into new love anything else about what this hookup leads to <coughs> wedding all right so uh i think that's gonna be all for today Hopefully this was helpful. If it was, give me a thumbs up on this video and subscribe so you can be notified when I post future videos. If you'd like, follow me on Instagram. You can follow me at It's Simply Sharon, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.